That uh, pretty much concludes our uh, program. I want to also, uh, and now if you think about, we've been doing business as a Tyler Police Department operating out in the downtown substation and the Martin Luther King substation for, I don't know, at least ever since I've been here, almost 34 years. And so when we make a change like this, there's a lot of strategic things that have to take place. And the strategic of getting officers down here, signing cars, my assistant chief, Steve Sharon, Steve, raise your hand, he's in the back, also had a critical role in that part of it. And if you can't think about coordinating all of that stuff and all that stuff to make it work and go out without a hitch, we started kind of moving down here last Monday and it's taken about a week to get everything in place and working out. We actually started about a year ago uh, on the assignments and starting to operate as two or actually three uh, stations. But anyway, please, there's, there's some snacks outside. Please make yourself at home. This is the Citizens Police Department uh, and station and please take a tour. We'll probably have some tour guys that can take you around and show you everything. And, and I just did want to just want to mention uh, my detectives kind of took it on their own, and they actually put their own coffee machine back there. So we're still going to have to we're still going to have to work that out. We might unplug it and make them go over there so they can have that. But it runs the whole plan. Yeah, it runs the plan. Initially, that's what we thought about the architects. Oh, it's great, but. My detectives that moved in here last week, that's the first thing I noticed. Oh, y'all put your own coffee pot in here. <laughs> anyway, well, we'll work on that. We may unplug it or make it say they can only use it one day a week. But anyway, that concludes our service. Thank you for coming, and please feel free to make yourself at home.